sweet young man was born about 32 years ago. I sold my first fancy diamond. Since then, I was always going against the stream. When everybody ran light, I went left. About 15 years ago, after I traveled around the world 100 times around the round, I decided we have to have a new way of marketing diamonds. So I started the Fancy Diamonds internet site. Fancy color diamonds were at the time a tiny little segment in the industry. And nobody really even considered to make a website and sell diamonds through the website. When we sold our first diamond for 80,000 on the website, I didn't believe myself. It took me half an hour to comprehend that we got $80,000 from a client on a stone which he never saw, just a picture on the web. Our business is a family undertaking and everybody is in it. My five children, my wife, and myself. The operation is not a family business, but a business for everything. It's run like a public company and not like a Yiddish lad. The diamond business is a complicated undertaking. Only people with a global reach and the ability to produce added value can survive. No more place for brokers. We buy diamonds worldwide from India, from Antwerp, and from Africa. We polish, we repolish, and end of the day, we make also jewelry in our own factory. Only that way we can reach with our website to the final customers, to dealers, to traders, in the best and the cheapest possible way. The diamond industry is a sentimental business. It's based on illusion, on mood, the industry is similar to a chameleon diamonds. When the stone is heated, it turns to orange. When the situation comes down, it will be a beautiful, strong, deep green. We like green pastry. That is our business, green and friendly.